by Ex Marcia. Kansas missed it. Check out my peas that I planted right here in the middle. My spinach and my lettuce. It's coming around. I had to put this wire around it to keep the chickens out. Let's go around and check out the rest of the garden. Got some onions the other day um, from Abundant Harvest on the free food giveaway, and some of them were growing. So I took them and planted them in the garden here that I had garlic in. So I put them in here, and hopefully they grow or continue to grow. And these onions here. I'm going to cut the tops off because you can see they're start getting ready to seed. I don't want them to seed. I want to cut them down so they can get bigger. So I'll cut those down and use them in some, in some scrambled eggs for breakfast or fried potatoes or whatever. Now we'll come over here. The other part of my garden, I've been working on it. Digging it by, by the shovel. I got... I don't know why... I guess I'm going to have to till this over again because my husband threw the chicken uh, stuff from the baby chickens. Just threw it in the garden. So I guess I have to till this whole thing over again, which ain't going to kill it. Ain't going to hurt me too much. I have to level that out in there. And then till that up over here because it hasn't been tilled yet because I just dug that up. And now re-till all this after I get it all level it out if it's not too muddy well my feet ain't sinking down so it must not be too muddy see my footprint isn't too deep and I have two rows of this weed barrier that I'm going to spread out and get those tomatoes planted sometime today I hope and that's that part of the garden now I'm so happy that we got our fruit trees planted when we first moved here because it's nothing like coming out and picking fruit from the trees. Here's a peach tree. Looky. Peaches are starting to grow on the peach tree all over. There's one peach tree and here's another peach tree right here had so many peaches on it one year broke the branch and that's the broken branch right there but you, this here needs I need to get some a, a saw or something and break cut these off because that don't need to be there that needs to be gone but you can see there's peaches on here too Sounds like one of the chickens is getting ready to lay. I plant, <laughs> look at the little baby chick on top of the waterer. Uh, Trying to make this big, there we go. See it? It's, it's so nice that they're still alive after that big rain we had. There's 18, 18 of them. Hopefully we still have 18, but as far as I can tell, they're all alive. Bring this back down to normal. Okay. In this tub, when the horse came to visit, <laughs> we plant, I planted turnips. I see some weeds in here. This is a weed. We don't need these in here. But I need to thin this out really bad. Because way too many turnips planted in here. But that's my turnip bed. I'll thin them out. A lot and I can use those turnip leaves as I thin them in my salads I don't know if there's anything growing in my herb garden this is my garden here guys I still need to get the ground worked up get all these weeds out put my weed barrier down and get my stuff planted I'm so far behind it's not funny 
in here I planted sage this first row nothing's growing yet and this one's lavender and fennel and this is Johnson grass <laughs> I need to get it out but it's way down in there so I just keep pulling it and let it keep coming back and there's lemon mint and this here row is basil and this here row is German uh, uh, German chamomile and then caraway and then dill purple opal basil rosemary and thyme give it time and they'll grow that white cage over there I'm gonna put cucumbers since they need to be transplanted soon and on one side and on the other side I'm gonna plant the Chinese red noodle beans and let them just bury that uh, berry cover that up with cucumbers and and the red Chinese beans I got onions left over from last year here also that um, I'm going to keep get keep continue. I got to cut the top off of them too but I got to continue to get keeping the weeds out because I don't want these to they're probably already too far gone because they're already um, training the seed but um, I'm gonna cut them and see if I can save them I need to get that done today and these here I'll give some greens to my mom she'll like that green onions but then thin these out because they're too close together to make one pound onions because I want one pound onions if possible well I'll probably start over here shoveling shoveling it up until my husband can get in here and get this tilled and I if you want something done these days you got to do it yourself so I will get in there and get started but when this when it gets shady at night I gotta quit because if I don't quit I'll get eaten up live with these mosquitoes so I'll just work my coon dog butt off all day. Get my steps in for my diet, trying to lose weight. Tone up my body. Get the garden planted with yummy food. And really change my life for the better. And you guys can follow along and watch. If you like this, please smash the like button. And... Uh, I pray that I can get everything planted that I want to grow and I hope that I can have plenty of food to store and store it properly and make some money at the farmers market possibly as well as giving to the to the at least 10% ties Ties ten percent of the best produce that I can make to the abundant harvest that gives food to people. They help me. I might as well give back, right? So I'll let you guys go, and I'll see you tomorrow with another video. Love you. Ta-ta.